Welcome to the tutorial of making a ball bearing assembly. Ball bearing assembly mainly consists of three parts balls, cage, and ribs. So we go to new, make a new assembly file. We get the cage part, we need this part to be fixed. So we take it default, rigid. There's no motion for this part. Now we need to get the ball part. Okay. Now we need this part, this ball to make a rotation in three directions in this volume about x, y, and z. So we take a ball connection and take this point in the middle with this one. Then click OK. Now let we drag it to show its motion. So if we take this point, we can make a rotation about the three axes we have okay we need to make this for all these parts okay now we need to get the race part this part will rotate inside this volume so we need to make it a pin connection so we take a pin and take this axis to be coincident with this but we still have to eliminate the translation in this axis so we activate the plane display and take this plane to be coincident with this plane there's no translation in this case now we need to get the upper part of the race this part will be fixed there's no motion so we do not use connections here after taking coincidence and then activate the axis display we need to make this axis coincident with this then take and use it activate the plane display we need this plane to be coincident with this okay then we click okay if we try to drag this component there's no motion the final part is the shaft part so again we take it as a pen connection between this central surface with this and coincident between this surface and this now if we try to drag it if we drag it it rotates the balls make this rotation and this part which represents the frame is fixed thank you for watching excuse my bad english thank you